So walking through, this is one area. These original windows, I believe some of them popped out. But as far as I can tell, this is the original wood up front. There is a little bit of deck rot up here. This is where somebody tried to fill it in with plaster. This deck originally was covered by somebody in garage floor epoxy sealant. Very thick. So I spent probably a good 200 hours scraping it off. This is what remains. You can see the planks are in pretty good shape. They're three wide. This is just decoration. And what I'll do is point out all the spots where I know that there's a little bit of rot right there. Pretty good over here. These are great. This back here is probably the worst of it. My plan, because these were complex curves, is I was just gonna sand it down and stain it. I took most of this out. sun, so most of the bright work is peeling. Not original sunroof somebody installed, definitely needs to be put back. I would definitely take out these motors through this before you patch it back up. Chimney for a diesel stove that I took out. Here we have the not well built new fly bridge. Definitely needs to be removed. Martini window, that's what it's actually called. You can see here how oh, the wood does not match. This is where somebody had put these storage bins. They did not drain them properly. This is not rotted through, but this could definitely be sealed. And put some new wood over it was the plan. 
This is from where I washed it yesterday. This bench is also not original and is not set to drain. I believe this board in the back though is original. This entire area here is bad wood, not marine plywood, needs to be replaced. Still strong, but needs to be replaced. You can see that the veneer on that is peeling. This door is solid, however, it does have one section down here where it's warped a little bit. Still works okay. It does hang up a little bit. And then, this is probably the worst of the outside wood. There's slight splitting here. But a little bit of fine woodworking should be okay. So there was originally another storage box down here that they had installed in the 80s and they cut this beautiful crisscrop ladder to do it. But you have the original ladder in order to make a template out of it. As you can see it's too short. Here's the anchor line for the nose. I didn't like it, I took it off. a shot of the transom here. You can see the sides are good. Transom was redone 2008. The right work is peeled off but the wood is good. We'll come across. The swim platform is not good. Okay, trying to film the inside of the transom here. Got my light on. The only reason it's wet down here is from when I washed the boat yesterday or when it rains it gets wet otherwise it stays very dry down here that rear bilge is not turned on ever as far as I know moving to the inside you can see that other side of that crack definitely fixable the inside is good so I would not take out that roof I would just Again, epoxy over it. Missing the veneer. This was built as an extension. So this originally, this piece was back here as a single bed. And then this side also had a single bed. It was this wide. This was converted into doors. And then as you can see, that was extended out to make a full bed. I kind of like this arrangement. I was going to turn this back into another bed though. Just to give more space. This is original. You can see the, the anchors.
Here's the bathroom. This shower is not original. Original door. I installed this hardwood floor. This was my buddy donated it, but it should have the proper mahogany cherry finish. Hot water tank. Got these out just to be able to film the motors. These panels are not original and should be replaced. You can see all the wood in here is in good shape but just needs to be finished in the correct color. All original wood, original ladder. See, they replaced these interiors with the incorrect interior wood and put way too many screws. Original, not original, not original. These are original, they're very cool. You can see the, the veneer here. Here's a better look. This is not original, it should be redone to match the curvature here. There's some mahogany veneer I bought, never used. There's the stairs, need to be remounted. 110 refrigerator. This area here, a lot of this is was not original and put in. Like these, these shelves are not original. This part up here is not, this part is original. These tiles are not original, I was gonna take those out. I also don't agree with putting a gas stove on a wooden boat, so I've never used it. Let me turn on that forward right. Originally, this only had a single bunk. The second bunk was added in. I actually kind of like it. It's well done. I'm gonna shine it out.
back in the head. So that's the double cabin. the original Chris Craft Red. There's the original, or the, not the original, but the installed giant generator. This is also the incorrect septic. This is about as much water as you'll see in it. And then it drains itself out. The water's cloudy because, again, I washed the boat yesterday, so it's a little soapy. Hot water tank, twin engine. That one seam right there. was inspected, fasteners need tightened, normal. Out of this side. Wood's in great shape. Needs the bungs installed. All this decking is solid. Again, this side was exposed to the sun, so you're going to see a lot of the bright work flaking. I also don't think the bright work was done correctly. Small concern here. 